Hi, you are watching PDMS tutorial. In this lesson, we will learn how to read PNID diagram. So it is a basic symbol used in a PNID diagram. You can download it from Google also. This is this shows pipe wall, one way wall, solenoid wall, analog wall, heat exchanger vessel, heater. And this line shows the instrument supply or connection to process and this line shows pneumatic signal and this dash line shows the electric signal and this line is used for software link and communication link and in PNID diagram there is a number as well as there is a name if first word is F that meant is flow here is a first letter define the measured or initiating variables such as analysis A, flow F, temperature T, etc. with succeeding letters defining function such as a indicator I, record R, transmit T and here is a F for flow, I for indicator and C is a controller. Only the first word here I want to show you. If first word is F that means is a flow rate. Here is a I also. I means current. If the first word is I, that means it is it is a current. It is a second word. That means it is an indicator. Here you can see succeeding letters. I is for indicator and C is for controller. If is a C word, uh, C word is a first, then it will be conductivity. And it is a tag number or tag name. So here. It is a PNID diagram for stabilizer. So here you can see this line represent pneumatic connection. This line dash line shows the electric signal. And this line shows the instrument supply or connectivity. Here you can see this is a pump. It has a name and everything in PNID have a name like this is a branch name 100 b1 100 is a bore size b1 its name branch 1 here is a 150 a57 150 is a bore size here it is a wall it means it is a one way and everything in PNID have a name so we will look this pump P1501A P1501B so here it is a 1501A we can see here and it is a 1501B so we can see here is a flange here is a wall then after this both are connecting to this and then there is a second wall sorry third wall and connected to N3 nozzle number 3 so in this diagram it is showing that this uh, this connection is uh, connected to N3 but uh, yeah, it is not accurate means it shows only instrument diagram and from where to where it is connected it only shows this it doesn't mean that uh, that you have to connect uh, in particular way it is showing that it is in exact same line but you can see in real diagram it is not connected in same line here we can track this line this is connected exactly in the middle and this pipe comes from here and then turn here to this and then wall it is turned here for some reason and connected to successfully N3 so in PNID you have to remember that so PNID only shows the instrument diagram and from where to where it is connected it shows it doesn't show that a particular line which is it is connected you can connect any any way or whatever you want and depending upon situation or or other department if if uh, there is a some wall or there is some stair you can shift this connection to other way so this is a basic of PNID 
होप यू लाइक इट एंड सब्सक्राइब एंड लाइक थैंक यू